U.S. President Joe Biden has dropped out of the presidential race and endorsed Vice President Kamal Harris as the Democratic nominee. Biden made the surprise announcement on Sunday. The 81-year-old quit the contest against former President Donald Trump. It has been the greatest honor of my life to serve as your president, Biden wrote on X social media platform. And while it has been my intention to seek re-election, I believe it is in the best interest of my party and the country for me to stand down and to focus solely on fulfilling my duties as president for the remainder of my term. Biden's decision comes amid mounting skepticism in recent weeks over his mental capabilities and his ability to effectively run a presidential campaign against his rival Donald Trump. It should be noted that it's the first time a U.S. president has dropped out of a re-election run in decades. Israel has launched airstrikes on Yemen's Red Sea port city of Hodeidah, one day after the deadly attack on Tel Aviv by Yemen's Houthi militant group. The strikes targeted oil storage facilities and a power plant in Hodeidah, igniting a fire in the area, according to official sources cited by Al Masira TV, the main television news outlet run by Yemen's Houthi movement. The news outlet quoted health officials as saying the air raids resulted in casualties, including fatalities, without specifying a number. Al Arabiya says 12 Israeli aircraft, including an F-35, targeted the port of Hodeidah. The attack comes after recent attack on Tel Aviv, for which Yemen's Houthi militant group has claimed responsibility. One person died and 19 others were injured in a drone attack on the U.S. Embassy in Tel Aviv on July 19. Israeli officials promised to respond to the attack with Defense Minister Yov Gallant saying in a message to the Houthis that Israel will settle the score with anyone who harms its security. أبناء استهداف ميناء الحديدة بغارات الطيران الصهيوني الأمريكي استهداف من ساعة النفط وأحد كرينات تنزيل الحاويات صلى الله عليه وسلم حنا خرجنا قبل شوية لا حول ولا قوة إلا بالله يوم القيامة أبناء استهداف ميناء الحديدة بغارات الطيران الصهيوني الأمريكي استهداف من ساعة النفط وأحد كرينات تنزيل الحاوية صلى الله عليه وسلم خرجنا قبل شوية لا حول ولا قوة إلا بالله يوم القيامة
من اجل غزه لو نصير رماد